you guys want to guess where we're going? How long are we going to be in the car? Yes. Oh, dark chocolate espresso bar. Mm -hmm. Who's that? Chapel Ben Franklin. Oh. Ben Franklin. No, ben Franklin. Ben Franklin. <laughs> oh my gosh. Here we are, Bush Gardens. Let's go do it. Yes. She was so excited. <laughs> This is what happens in the Dolly Hotel. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. It is the last morning of our vacation. When I say last morning, I mean like we have to be out of here by 10 a.m. It's not really a day of vacation. So we bought seven and a half dozen eggs to come down here. And we had about a dozen left this morning, so we're scrambling them all up. Everybody's getting their fill of scrambled eggs. There's Brennan over there eating his scrambled eggs. He can't hear me. Maybe he can. All right. So there's Nana getting everything all situated. So we're going to go ahead and pack up and go. So everybody's going home today. We are not. We have one extra day. That's why I'm wearing my vacation shirt. One extra day of vacation before we go home. So we're going to go to that place today and have a great time, which we're very excited about. And then we're home tomorrow, which is Saturday. So hang out with us. We'll give you a quick, maybe, maybe we'll give you a little tour of the house again, or at least definitely the beach again, because it's my favorite view ever. It's so gorgeous out there. I'm going to be really sad to miss it, but very excited to come back next year. So uh, stay tuned to find out what we do today, where we go. And now we're leaving. So they never finished the puzzle. The dad left this beautiful note. Attention new guests, we brought this puzzle and did not finish it. Hopefully if you wish, you will complete it and leave it for new guests. We had a great time and hope you do also. Regards, July 23 to 30 renters. That is so great. Good job, dad. You guys want to guess where we're going? How long are we going to be in the game? Do I look like the Matrix guy? You no. do look like it. Hey, did you pop that thing back in? Yeah. I dropped those sunglasses to Brendan and the lens leaving. popped out. All right, family check. Two. Three. Four. Five. Oh. A little slow. Let's try it again. Double check. Two. Three. Four. Five. That's better. That's nice better. work. Five. All right, you guys. Okay, rate that vacation on a scale of one to ten. Ryan. Ten. Brennan. Four. Katie. One. Oh, Dad. Eight. <laughs> Ten is the highest game. No, that was a joke. Oh, I thought I thought one was the highest. No, you silly goose. Okay, I would have to say eight. Okay. Eight I'm going to say nine and a half. Eight and a half. I loved it. I absolutely loved it. Okay, very good. Well, it sounds like it was a resounding success. What did you say, Mike? What was your number? Eight. Eight. Oh. Oh. I think it was a ten, Mom. I thought so, too. I loved it. All right, so... so how long are we going to be in the car so we can guess distance-wise? Okay, we'll be in the car for about two hours and 15 minutes. Um, we're going to Nashville. Virginia Beach. Nashville, no. Virginia Beach, no. Chincoteague. No. A museum. Are we no. going north or south? <laughs> uh, am I allowed to answer that question? Just... Are well, we going yeah, north? Yeah, you can, because if we go, if we're going north, we're going two hours closer to home. If we're going south, we're going two hours further away from home. Are we going Which means north? a more uncomfy ride on the way home. Oh my gosh. Right in the middle. Are we going north? <laughs> we're going north. Oh. <laughs> oh God. It's like, it's like it, seven hours. It's so. on the way home. We're going, it's on the way home okay, where good. we're going. Seven hours is like the perfect amount of time that like you want to be in the car before you actually want to like... Die. Die? <laughs> okay. um, but like nine and a half hours is like you want to die. Well, we're not going to. Oh, if we went, oh, if we went the other way, hours, I see what you're saying. Three hours just feel like a oh, new eternity. And it's not seven hours anyway, it's, it's five seven, and a half. Oh my gosh, you see that guy's bike? Do you see those handlebars? That was cool. Okay, are you uh, done yeah. guessing? Uh, is it in North Carolina? No. Is it in Virginia? Yes. Where are we Bush going Gardens. in Virginia? Bush Gardens. Bush Gardens! Oh, yeah. Wait, are we say, are we staying overnight? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> At a really Come nice on. hotel. How are you doing? Are you excited? Yes. Okay. She has to change clothes. You're not gonna wear that. I know. I'm gonna oh. Change clothes. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Oh, One more day on our vacation at Bush Gardens, and then we'll go home tomorrow. Sound oh, good? Let's go. Sounds yeah, amazing. boy. 
Great success. Great success. It'll be fun. Wait, I didn't know there was bush gardens in Virginia. There is. But we're having a little delay because we're in the gift shop. No, All dad wants to do is get in room. All these guys want to do is shop and play games, which is fine. Do you know how to play that game? <laughs> All right, Brennan. So, so far, we've checked in. We went to the pool. We didn't swim, but we were just waiting for our room to get ready. Then we, we decided that we want to eat. We're going to eat a little bit of something. So we're getting a little bit of a delay going to Bush Gardens because we're so enamored with Colonial Williamsburg and what's going on here. It's a beautiful hotel that we're staying in, so it's almost like we just want to like explore the resort. Um, we're right across the street from Colonial Williamsburg, which if you don't know what that is, it's a, it's, a, it's like a, I think it's a national park. I don't know if it's a national park, but it's the historic downtown Williamsburg. Um, from Colonial America, and you can do all kinds of things. Learn how to make candles, learn history about George shoot Washington, a shoot a musket, all I'm kinds of like colonial things, horse-drawn carriage, all that stuff. So we're kind of torn. We might do that. Look. Yeah. Is it a book? It's a picture book. It's like old. It's like old. Well, I want to bring the books out. Someone important. <laughs> okay. Ghosts among us. Look at here's all that. Look at. Oh my gosh, Jinger, Pride and Prejudice, Les Miserables, what, what, what? Don Quixote, all what? these. These are all very, these are all classics, right here. Dracula, Frankenstein, wow, Huckleberry Finn, The Jungle Book, look at The Jungle Book, Peter Pan. Those are beautiful books. Treasure Island. Jungle Book. Who do you want to read about? The Jungle Book? Is this about the Jungle Book? Is this like the Jungle Book? The Jungle Book? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, look at you can get um, chocolate with your favorite president. Can I just talk oh my gosh. <laughs> Where's. Where's. There you go. GW? My there boy you go. Like, Brennan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do, you want, do you want your favorite colonial American chocolate? Oh, wait, they're all different. Oh, it's a dark chocolate special. Milk chocolate bar with popping candy. Milk, milk Ooh, as of right oh, now, popping. it's oh, going to look like. <laughs> I'm getting the George Washington crush bar. Okay. Who's this? James Madison. I can't read it. Is it James Madison? I can't read it. Yes. Oh, dark chocolate espresso bar. Mm -hmm. Who's that? Chuck Oh, Ben Franklin. Ben Franklin. No, ben Franklin. <laughs> oh my gosh. Katie, you needed to be a little more educated. Yeah. Well, we on your you history. Should I get the dark chocolate John espresso bar? John Adams is just regular milk chocolate. Oh, that's what Dad would like. Unless there's one with almonds. <laughs> it's milk funny because Dad. So do I want dark chocolate or dark chocolate almonds? I just have one of these. I'll get a regular. Yeah. Get a regular. Oh, I don't know. Not yet. Oh, well, do you like better, Benjamin Franklin or? I bet. James Madison. Bet. Realistically. Dark chocolate on. Okay. All right, we need to eat something. So let's, let's, I'm starving. Let's, let's go. Let's colonial chocolate. chocolate. I really could out. stay in this um, oh, forever. More chocolate. More chocolate. <laughs> okay, let's look go. at, Ooh. look at, pa dear old mom, spiced ale. Spiced this ale. is a great store. I wonder how long this is going to be <laughs> open. <laughs> what? Let's go. How do you write? 700. Like it's going out of time. Like you're running out of time. Yeah, like, 30 this is what George Washington. About anything. About anything. Like today we crushed brewskis with the boys. This is what George Washington crushed with the boys. <laughs> what? <laughs> like when they won the revolution, they. Were just oh, they just in. cheered with some brewskis. Or Sam Adams just made them some. Maybe yes, it could be. Hello, Rosie. Is your name Rosie? <laughs> you look more like a Martha. Why is the Union Jack here? You know, you know, you know. Yo, okay. Let's get, let's get uh, playing cards. Oh, oh yeah, we gotta get cards. Yes. American Revolutionary? Oh, it's a card it's game. It's a card game, so it's not. Uh, oh, there's oh, playing cards right behind it. Playing cards. Are they Williamsburg? Ew. Colonial Williamsburg playing cards. Yeah, that's perfect. Here, that's what we do. All right, let's go. The mind breathing elevator. Right, exactly. Oh. Is that working? Oh, you know what? You need your room key. Hold on. That's cool. Mm -hmm. oh, this is a hotel room. Yeah. 
a it's a big room. Not a great view. Hmm. I feel like I'm about to be. Though. I feel like I'm about to go fight the British. Is that right? You get a good night's sleep and then go fight the so, British. Yeah, this is actually the bed that. Um... <laughs> what? No, I said I'm going to fight the British. Do I get that bed? Yeah. Yes, you do. That's oh yours. God, and then Brendan and Ryan get one of okay. these, and Dad and I get the other. The All right, you guys. Check in to see what we're going to do. We're doing it. Yeah, that's funny. 76ers. Here in Colonial Williamsburg, why 76? What does that have to do with we anything? What do you mean? We love 76. But in Williamsburg, back in the day, they don't know what 76. 76, we're going to sign a sick document, and then we're going to leave. Basically. And then we're going to have a basketball team that celebrates it. And then? It was just a list of crimes against King George III. Oh. All right, you guys, here we are, Bush Gardens. Let's go do it, yes. Okay, the gang is on the roller coaster right behind me, right there. They're in row two or three. Uh, let's see if we can capture them, come down that, and almost like oh, try to stay out of that river. Nine only 
because I shook my head. Love it. It was fun though. Good job, really guys. Fun. That's awesome. All right, what's next, everybody? Are we doing that right or now? That's let's a, that's really tough. Let's go. Ten, 10 out of 10, purely just because mom is so freaking cute when she's <laughs> laughing. She was so excited. <laughs> she's gonna be so excited. Scale 1 to 10? Oh, it's fun, don't get me wrong, but like, mom <laughs> loves it a little bit too much. No, it was too much. Number? It's it was too much fun. It was, it was fun. Mom Number? I loved it. It just tickles your tummy. It does. It's a fair ride. I love, I love that ride. What's the number? Thank you. 10. Yeah, Brian? 8. Brennan? Seven. Seven. Wow. All right. What'd you get? So much fun at Bush Gardens. We had such a great time. We were really only here for about I don't know, five hours maybe, 11, 20, maybe six hours. But we rode six roller coasters and the back and forth thing, so much fun. But we're gonna go home, we're exhausted, and um, hang out at the hotel, probably get a nice dinner. I would love to go to the pool, but I don't think it's gonna be open. But we'll see what we're gonna do a little bit later. Kate, did you have a good time, baby girl? Yes, I did. I had a great time. Yeah. I'm exhausted though. <laughs> yeah. I came here already tired. And there's just gonna be so much more tired. But, but you did a good job. I really, really, really want to watch the Jungle Cruise. Movie. All right, well, let's have a nice dinner and then we'll watch the movies. That sound good? Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> So me and Brian were thinking, instead of buying food in the park, you could just order a za, like a pizza, to the outside of the park, mm -hmm. go and get it, okay. and bring it back Smoking in, because it's way yeah. less money. For a lot less expensive. Also, I was thinking that, you know like the Amazon drone stuff? I was thinking, because Amazon also does food. You could have a drone fly over, okay. like while you're on a ride or something, uh -huh. or, or just chill them in the park, and just have it deliver you groceries or like food, <laughs> you know? Like, I, like if, they, if they just dropped me down like a pack of like applesauce, I'd be so happy. Like granola bars. But you might have to pay $100,000 for that. For the, yeah, Which for is a lot more sauce. expensive than buying, yeah, buying maybe. food in the park. But still, it's better than a, a still. Or we're going to start up a, a, a park food delivery service. Yep. So stay posted on that. Start yep. up. Start up. Start up. Uh, we'll no, we'll figure out the food later. park. Yeah, we'll figure out later. <laughs> We went home and did a quick change, and now we're walking to a hotel next to our hotel. This is the Williamsburg Inn. Absolutely gorgeous. We're gonna have dinner in there. We hope to have dinner in there. We'll put it that way. I did not make a reservation, but we're gonna see. Hopefully we can eat. <laughs> Ryan is very excited about his meal. He can't even stand it. How, how do you just not look at that and just, your mouth just drool? Oh, we're enjoying a beautiful meal. And of course, there's a golf course here, but Ryan can sniff them out anywhere. So I'm a little bit confused. I know that's the short game area over there. And obviously that's the park screen. But it looks like there's bag holders. Is the range just that way? I'm confused. So I know, right that's there. weird. I don't know. So there's just a chair and a table right there. I love that everything's grass here. And I looked back and I'm like, wow, that is a beautiful It's shot. very pretty. Can I turn around? I don't want to bother anybody with my light, no, but fine. oh my goodness. That is gorgeous. What a beautiful hotel. Yeah. The woman told me it's on the historic register of hotels. 
built by the Rockefellers in wow. the 1937, I think, wow. which is the year Pat they was were born. Jillionaires, <laughs> right? Rockefeller last year in, in Carnegie. Uh huh. Well, we've come out to explore the outside and it looks like yeah, we're a, locked out and these people won't let like, us it's in. A colonial five -star hotel. <laughs> they won't let us in and it's raining. It's Look at it, it's raining now. <laughs> Guys, it's raining out here. Thanks for nothing. <laughs> we are finishing our night in the hotel watching the Olympics, just watching some swimming. Fantastic. I know. What a great day, Michael. What made you happy today, babe? Uh, our safe journey here to Williamsburg. Yeah? Yep. Excellent. You're a good safe driver, Mike. Mm. Thank you. Another safe delivery. Totally. Nice work. Yes. Thank you. Katie Kate, what made you happy today, baby girl? <sighs> Going to have fun with my family. That was fun. We had a good time, didn't we? Yeah. All Even though today. you were tired, you, you stuck it out, Kate. Yeah. We rode a lot of roller coasters, didn't we? Yeah. And we had a lot of fun laughs, didn't we? Yeah. And a good dinner. Ew. <laughs> what made you happy, my guy? What didn't make me happy? Oh my gosh, it was such that? a great day. Yeah? Uh, the first roller coaster we went on made me extremely happy. Uh, being with the family and the burger I had at dinner. <laughs> it made me insanely happy. And just the conversation <laughs> doing my family all day. Um, super, super fun. Nice surprise, right? Also, I love, so, Brennan, by the way. Brennan just take her. Brennan! Come on, Brennan! Up. Brennan! Stand up and leave him with me, you know? oh. this, is, this is why, this is what happens in the Donnelly Hotel. <laughs> Brennan! Um, no, no, what made me really, really happy, though, was we got here and Katie wasn't in the best of moods. And then, I don't know, we, me and Dad and Brennan went to, like, the pool and Katie, like, changed in to, like, a dress. Because she was in like like a uh, uh, sweatshirt and sweatpants, and then she changed her dress. She came back, and she was just in this great Katie mood, and it was just changes everything, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, we went yes. to the gift shop. It was very fun. By nice the way, I'm holding out my muscle, so it looks like my arm is huge. You look and it's very strong. Working. Look at how big. <laughs> oh my gosh! You look. are like the bomb. <laughs> anyway, hey Brennan. All right, I'll share this until Brennan gets back from whatever it is he's doing. What made me happy today was just having an amazing family day. I, it's hard to say goodbye to my family this morning, my extended family, my mom and dad, my brothers and sisters, but um, I cherish the time as well with just our nuclear family. And I call me crazy, but I'm as a mom, I'm I'm kind of very sad about well i'm definitely sad about the fact that brian's going to college but i'm really really actually very excited for him but i'm sad that it will change our family dynamic a little bit because we won't be the five of us so it's nice to spend just that family five together so um that all day long was just i'm in my element so i love it and we'll get brennan's what made him happy today in just a second here's my boy what made you happy today babe uh made me happy today was uh <laughs> what is Vargas? Dinner was really, really gas. And it was fun. Uh, it's been last for the day. Uh, Bush Are you yeah. sure? Excellent. Yes. All right, want to take it out with me? It's under country. Yes. yes. Right, I'll stand take it away, Jill. All right, ready? Come bring me. You guys have a <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you guys tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.